Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is Can you discuss the options for integrating? Power BI with external data sources or APIs using custom connectors or Power Query data sources and how do you ensure data security and compliance in data integration workflows? Your answer should be Power BI can integrate with external data sources or APIs using custom connectors, Power Query data sources or direct query connections. Ensuring data security and compliance involves implementing encryption, access controls, and data masking in data integration workflows and connections. Our next interview question is What are the considerations for designing power automate flows for data migration or synchronization? between cloud and on-premises systems ensuring data integrity and consistency. Your answer should be designing flows with incremental data loading or synchronization mechanisms, implementing data validation and error handling, and scheduling data migration or synchronization tasks during off-peak hours ensures data integrity and consistency in Power Automate workflows. Our next interview question is how do you approach designing Power Virtual Agents chatbots for user authentication and personalized experiences enabling access to secure resources and user-specific data? Your answer should be integrating chatbots with authentication providers like Azure AD or OAuth, implementing single sign-on SSO or multi-factor authentication MFA, and querying user-specific data based on authentication context ensures secure access and personalized experiences in Power Virtual Agents chatbots. Our next interview question is Can you discuss the options for embedding Power Apps, Canvas Apps, or model driven apps into custom wave applications or portals? And how do you ensure seamless integration and user experience? Your answer should be Power Apps, Canvas Apps, or model driven apps can be embedded into custom wave applications or portals using iframe embed code, direct URL links, or Power Apps portals. Ensuring seamless integration involves configuring app permissions, styling app interfaces to match the host application, and implementing authentication and authorization mechanisms. Our next interview question is what are the considerations for designing Power BI reports and dashboards for real-time data streaming scenarios ensuring timely insights and decision making? Your answer should be designing reports with streaming datasets utilizing real-time visuals like line charts or gauges and configuring automatic data refresh intervals ensures real-time data streaming and timely insights in Power BI reports and dashboards. Our next interview question is how do you approach designing Power Automate flows for data enrichment and augmentation leveraging external data sources or APIs? Your answer should be designing flows to retrieve data from external sources or APIs, integrating data enrichment services or algorithms, and updating 
or augmenting existing data with enriched information ensures data enrichment and augmentation in Power Automate workflows. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for extending Power Virtual Agents chatbots with custom actions or business logic and how would you approach integrating custom code or external services with chatbots? Your answer should be Power Virtual Agents chatbots can be extended with custom actions using Power Automate flows, Azure functions or custom APIs. Integrating custom code or external services involves defining actions, parameters and triggers and invoking them within chatbot conversations or workflows. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is, how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for operational analytics and monitoring enabling users to track key performance indicators, KPIs, and business metrics in real time. Your answer should be designing reports with operational KPIs and metrics, utilizing real-time data streaming and refresh, and configuring alerts and notifications for threshold-based monitoring ensures operational analytics and monitoring in Power BI reports and dashboards. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for extending Power Virtual Agents chatbots with custom user interfaces or channels? And how would you approach developing and deploying custom chatbot interfaces? Your answer should be Power Virtual Agents chatbots can be extended with custom user interfaces or channels using embedded wave chat, Microsoft Teams integration, or custom chatbot clients. Developing and deploying custom chatbot interfaces involves designing UI components, implementing chatbot logic, and integrating with messaging platforms or channels. Our next interview question is, what are the considerations for designing Power Automate flows for data migration or replication between cloud environments ensuring consistency and reliability in data synchronization? Your answer should be designing flows with incremental data synchronization, implementing data validation and conflict resolution strategies, and scheduling data replication tasks during off-peak hours ensures consistency and reliability in data migration or replication workflows in Power Automate. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for executive or strategic decision making enable users to gain insights and visualize trends for strategic planning? Your answer should be designing reports with executive dashboards, strategic KPIs, and trend analysis visuals utilizing features like forecasting and what-if analysis and incorporating drill-down capabilities for deeper insights ensures support for executive or strategic decision-making in Power BI. 
Our next interview question is can you discuss the capabilities of the Power Apps component framework PCF and how it enables developers to build custom controls for Power Apps applications? Your answer should be the Power Apps component framework PCF allows developers to build custom controls using HTML, CSS and TypeScript and integrate them into Power Apps applications. It provides capabilities for creating reusable and extensible UI components for enhanced app functionality and user experience. Our next interview question is, what are the considerations for designing Power Apps, Canvas Apps or model-driven apps of for offline scenarios, ensuring data availability and functionality when users are offline. Your answer should be designing apps with local data storage capabilities, implementing offline synchronization mechanisms, and enabling offline access to essential features and functionalities, ensures data availability and usability in offline scenarios. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is What is the Power Platform Center of Excellence COE Starter Kit and how can it be benefit organizations implementing Power Platform solutions? Your answer should be the Power Platform COE Starter Kit provides a set of templates, tools, and best practices for establishing a center of excellence COE to govern and drive adoption of Power Platform within an organization. It helps in implementing governance policies, monitoring users, and fostering collaboration and innovation. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power BI reports for mobile consumption and what considerations should be taken into account for optimizing the mobile experience? Your answer should be designing reports with responsive layouts, optimized visuals, and touch-friendly interactions ensures a seamless mobile experience. Utilizing features like mobile layout view, responsive slicers, and drill-through navigation enhances usability and accessibility on mobile devices. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for integrating Power BI reports and dashboards into custom applications or portals? Your answer should be Power BI offers embedded options such as Power BI Embedded, Power BI JavaScript API, and Power BI REST API for integrating reports and dashboards into custom applications or portals. These options allow for seamless embedding of Power BI content while retaining interactivity and security. Our next interview question is, how would you approach designing Power Apps portals for external facing scenarios such as customer portals or partner portals? Your answer should be, I would start by identifying user personas, defining user journeys and determining portal objectives and content. Leveraging portal templates, customizing portal themes, and configuring 
authentication and access controls ensures a tailored and secure experience for external users. Our next interview question is what is the role of AI in power platform solutions and how can AI capabilities be leveraged to enhance business processes? Your answer should be AI capabilities in power platform such as AI Builder and Azure AI Services integration enable tasks such as predictive analytics, image recognition, sentiment analysis, and chatbot development. Leveraging AI enhances automation, decision making, and user engagement in business processes. Our next interview question is, how do you ensure data lineage and traceability in Power BI reports and data sets, especially in scenarios involving complex data transformation and multiple data sources? Your answers should be utilizing features like data lineage view, documentation tools, and metadata annotations in Power BI ensures transparency and traceability of data sources, transformation and calculations. Maintaining documentation and version control facilitates understanding and auditing of data lineage. Our next interview question is what considerations should be taken into account when designing Power Automate flows that interact with external APIs or services. Your answer should be understanding authentication mechanisms, rate limits, error handling, and data format requirements of external APIs is crucial. Utilizing connectors or custom HTTP actions, implementing retry policies, and handling Authentication securely ensures reliable interaction with external services. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is, how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for real-time monitoring and operational analytics ensuring timely insights for decision making. Your answer should be designing reports with real-time data streaming, utilizing streaming data sets and real-time visuals like tiles and cards and configuring automatic refresh schedules ensures real-time monitoring and operational analytics in Power BI for timely decision making. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for integrating Power Automate with external databases or data sources securely? And how do you ensure data encryption and compliance with data protection regulations? Your answer should be Power Automate can integrate with external databases or data sources via connectors, custom APIs, or Azure services like Azure Data Factory or Azure Logic Apps. Ensuring data encryption and compliance involves implementing secure data connections, encryption protocols, and access controls in integration workflows. Our next interview question is what are the key considerations for designing Power Apps Canvas apps for responsive and adaptive layouts ensuring optimal 
user experiences across different devices and screen sizes. Your answer should be designing Canvas apps with flexible layouts utilizing containers and layout controls and leveraging responsive design techniques like size and position constraints ensure optimal user experiences across various devices and screen resolutions. Our next interview question is how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for storytelling and data-driven narratives, ensuring effective communication of insights to stakeholders? Your answer should be structuring reports with narrative elements like titles, subtitles, and annotations utilizing storytelling techniques such as guided tours and bookmarks and incorporating data storytelling best practices ensures effective communications of insights and narratives in Power BI reports and dashboards. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for integrating Power Virtual Agents chatbots with external knowledge bases or FAQs? And how would you approach leveraging external content for chatbot responses? Your answer should be Power Virtual Agents chatbots can integrate with external knowledge bases or FAQs via custom connectors, APIs, or direct data connections. Leveraging external content involves querying and retrieving relevant information dynamically based on user inquiries and context within chatbot conversations. Our next interview question is, what are the considerations for designing Power Automate flows for long-term retention and archival of data or documents, ensuring compliance with data retention policies and regulations. Your answer should be designing flows with archival actions or triggers, implementing retention policies and archival schedules, and utilizing storage services like SharePoint or Azure Blob Storage for long-term data retention ensures compliance with data retention policies and regulations in Power Automate. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is what is Microsoft Power Platform and what components does it include? Your answer should be Microsoft Power Platform is a suite of tools comprising Power BI, Power Apps, Power Automate, formerly known as Flow, and Power Virtual Agents. These tools empower users to analyze data, create custom applications, automate workflows, and build chatbots. Our next interview question is, how do you determine which Power Platform tool is appropriate for a specific business scenario? Your answer should be understanding the requirements of the scenario is crucial. Power BI is for data analysis and visualization, Power Apps for custom application development, Power Automate for workflow automation and Power Virtual Agents for creating chatbots. Analyzing the needs will guide the selection. Our next interview question is, can you explain the concept of common data service 
CDS in Power Platform. Your answer should be Common Data Service is a secure data platform that allows you to store and manage business entities in a standardized and extensible way. It provides a common data model for seamless integration across Power Platform applications and Dynamics 365. Our next interview question is, how do you approach integrating Power Platform with existing systems and applications within an organization? Your answer should be integration typically involves connecting to data sources using connectors, APIs, or custom connectors. Understanding the data structure, security requirements, and business processes is essential. Leveraging connectors or custom development ensures seamless integration. Our next interview question is what are Canvas apps and model-driven apps in Power Apps and when would you use each? Your answer should be Canvas apps allow for more flexible, custom-built user interfaces and are suitable for scenarios requiring highly customized layouts and interactions. Model-driven apps, on the other hand, are based on the common data service and provide a more structured approach ideal for complex business processes. Our next interview question is, how would you design a solution in Pl Power Platform to automate a repetitive business process? Your answer should be, I would start by mapping out the existing process, identifying pain points, and determining areas suitable for automation. Power Automate would be utilized to create workflows integrating with relevant systems or applications streamlining the process and reducing manual intervention. Our next interview question is, can you explain the concept of environments in Power Platform and how would you manage them in an enterprise environment? Your answer should be environments in Power Platform provide logical separation for development, testing, and production environments. Proper governance is crucial, establishing policies for environment provisioning, security, and life cycle management to ensure efficient and secure operations. Our next interview question is, how do you ensure data security and compliance when working with Power Platform? Your answer should be implementing role-based access control, RBAC, data loss prevention DLP policies and complying with regulatory requirements such as GDPR or HIPAA are essential. Leveraging features like data encryption, data loss prevention policies and data sovereignty capabilities ensures data security and compliance. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today, we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is, what are the key considerations for designing Power BI datasets optimized for performance and scalability? Your answer should be designing efficient data models with appropriate granularity, optimizing data loading and refresh strategies, utilizing query folding and partitioning, and leveraging direct query or import mode 
based on data volume and complexity ensures performance and scalability in Power BI datasets. Our next interview question is how do you approach designing power automate flows for orchestrating complex business processes involving multiple dependencies and conditional logic? Your answer should be breaking down the process into smaller manageable steps utilizing control actions like switch and do until and implementing conditional branching and parallel execution ensures effective orchestration of complex business processes in Power Automate flows. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the role of Power Platform integration with Microsoft Azure Services and how can Azure Services enhance Power Platform solutions? Your answer should be integration with Azure services such as Azure Functions, Azure Logic Apps, and Azure Cognitive Services extends the capabilities of Power Platform solutions with custom code execution, advanced workflows, and AI capabilities enabling enhanced automation, integration, and intelligence. Our next interview question is how do you approach designing Power Apps components for reuse across multiple applications and what are the benefits of component-based development? Your answer should be identifying common UI elements or functionalities, designing reusable components using Power Apps component framework, PCF, and publishing them to the component library enables reuse across multiple Power Apps applications. Component-based development improves consistency, efficiency, and maintainability of applications. Our next interview question is, what role does Microsoft Dataverse play in enabling low code application development with power apps and how does it simplify data management and integration your answer should be microsoft dataverse provides a secure and scalable data storage platform for power apps applications with built-in data validation relationships and business logic it simplifies data management and integration by offering standardized data schemas, native integration with Power Platform components, and support for custom entities and workflows. Our next interview question is How would you approach designing a Power Virtual Agents chatbot to handle natural language understanding NLU? and user intent recognition effectively. Your answer should be designing intents, entities, and utterances based on user interactions and business requirements, training the chatbot using sample dialogues, and refining the language understanding model iteratively ensures accurate recognition of user intents and natural language understanding in Power Virtual Agents. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for extending Power Automate capabilities with custom connectors and how would you approach developing and publishing custom connectors for integration with external systems? Your answer should be Power Automate allows for extending capabilities with custom connectors developed using Power Platform Connectors, SDK, or Azure API Management. Developing custom connectors involves defining endpoints, authentication methods, and actions, and publishing them to the Power Platform Connector marketplace for consumption. 
If you are preparing for any Microsoft based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for predictive analytics and forecasting leveraging machine learning models or statistical algorithms? Your answer should be integrating predictive analytics models or forecasting algorithms into Power BI reports using custom visuals, DAX calculations, or external services like Azure Machine Learning and configuring parameters and inputs for predictive analysis ensures accurate forecasting and predictive insights. Our next interview question is can you discuss the role of Microsoft Dataverse, formerly Common Data Service, in Power Platform Solutions and how it facilitates data integration, storage, and management. Your answer should be Microsoft Dataverse provides a secure and scalable data storage platform for Power Platform Solutions with built-in data validation, relationships, and business logic. It facilitates data integration, storage, and management across Power Platform components, ensuring data consistency and reliability. Our next interview question is, what are the options for integrating Power Automate with on-premises systems or databases securely? ensuring data privacy and compliance with regulatory requirements. Your answer should be Power Automate can integrate with on-premises systems or databases securely using on-premises data gateway, virtual network integration, or hybrid connections. Ensuring data privacy and compliance involves encrypting data in transit and at risk, implementing access controls and complying with regulatory standards. Our next interview question is how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for self-service analytics enabling users to explore and analyze data independently? Your answer should be designing reports with interactive visuals, slicers, and filters enabling drill-down and drill-through capabilities and providing user training and documentation on Power BI features and functionalities, ensures self-service analytics and user empowerment. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for extending Power Virtual Agents chatbots with custom code or business logic and how would you approach integrating external services or APIs with chatbots? Your answer should be Power Virtual Agents chatbots can be extended with custom code or business logic using Power Automate flows. Azure functions or custom connectors. Integrating external services or APIs involves defining actions, parameters, and triggers and invoking them within chatbot conversations or workflows. Our next interview question is What are the considerations for designing Power Automate flows? for business process automation, ensuring efficiency, reliability, and scalability. Your answer should be identifying automation triggers and actions 
optimizing flow logic and dependencies, implementing error handling and retries, and monitoring flow performance and resource utilization ensures efficient, reliable, and scalable business process automation in Power Automate. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today, we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is, can you discuss the role of Microsoft Teams integration in Power Platform solutions and how can Teams be leveraged as a collaboration platform for Power Platform users? Your answer should be integration with Microsoft Teams allow Power Platform users to access and interact with Power BI reports, Power Apps, and Power Automate flows directly within the Teams interface. Teams can serve as a central hub for collaboration, communication, and task management, enhancing productivity and user engagement. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power Automate flows for data synchronization and replication between systems or databases? Your answer should be, I would start by identifying data sources, defining synchronization requirements, and mapping data fields between systems. Utilizing trigger-based or scheduled flows, leveraging data operations actions like create, update, and delete, and implementing error handling ensures reliable data synchronization and replication. Our next interview question is, what are the options for extending Power BI capabilities with custom visuals and how would you approach selecting and integrating custom visuals into Power BI reports? Your answer should be Power BI allows for integrating custom visuals from the Power BI marketplace or developing custom visuals using the Power BI Visuals SDK. Selecting custom visuals based on visualization requirements, user preferences, and compatibility with data sources ensures effective integration and enhanced report visualization. Our next interview question is How do you approach designing Power Virtual Agents chatbots to handle? multi-turn conversations and context switching. Your answer should be designing conversation flows with branching logic, entity recognition, and content variables enables handling multi-turn conversations and context switching in Power Virtual Agents chatbots. Utilizing memory variables, topic switching, and proactive prompts enhances user engagement and interaction flow. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for monitoring and troubleshooting Power Platform solutions and how would you approach diagnosing and resolving performance issues or errors? Your answer should be Power Platform provides monitoring capabilities such as Power Platform Admin Center, Power BI uses metrics, and Power Automate Analytics for tracking users, performance, and errors. Diagnosing performance issues involves analyzing resource utilization, 
query performance and network latency and resolving errors requires debugging flows, analyzing logs and applying corrective actions. Our next interview question is what are the considerations for data retention and archival policies when working with power platform solutions that involve historical data or regulatory compliance requirements? Your answer should be establishing data retention policies based on regulatory requirements, business needs and data lifecycle ensures compliance and efficient data management. Implementing archival processes, utilizing data lifecycle management features in Microsoft, Dataverse, or Azure, and applying encryption and access controls to archived data ensures security and compliance with retention policies. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is, how would you design a Power Virtual Agent's chatbot to provide personalized customer support experiences? Your answer should be, I would start by understanding common customer inquiries and designing conversation flows to address them. Utilizing AI capabilities for natural language processing, NLP, entity recognition, and sentiment analysis enables personalized responses and efficient handling of customer queries. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the role of Power Apps portals in extending Power Platform solutions to external users or customers? Your answer should be Power Apps portals provide a platform for building external facing websites or portals that allow users outside the organization to interact with Power Platform applications. They enable scenarios such as customer self-service, partner collaboration, and community engagement, extending the reach of Power Platform solutions. Our next interview question is, how do you approach testing and quality assurance of Power Platform solutions before deployment to products and environments? Your answer should be establishing a comprehensive testing strategy covering functional testing, integration testing, performance testing, and user acceptance testing and source solution quality. Utilizing tools like Power Platform built tools, automated testing frameworks, and test environments facilitates efficient testing and validation. Our next interview question is, what are the options for deploying Power Platform solutions across different environments? And how do you manage the release process? Your answer should be options for deployment include solutions packaging, Power Platform build tools, or utilizing deployment pipelines in Azure DevOps. Managing the release process involves version control, environment management, release validation, and rollback strategies to ensure smooth deployments across environments. Our next interview question is, how would you approach designing a Power BI data model for complex reporting requirements involving multi-data sources and relationships? Your answer should be, I would start by understanding the data sources, 
relationships and reporting requirements. Utilizing techniques like data modeling, data shaping, and query optimization in Power Query Editor and defining relationships and measures in the data model ensures accurate and efficient reporting for complex scenarios. Our next interview question is, can you explain the concept of Power Platform data flows and how they contribute to data integration and transformation? Your answer should be Power Platform data flows allow users to ingest, transform, and combine data from various sources into standardized data sets. They provide capabilities for data cleansing, transformation, and enrichment, facilitating data integration and preparation for analysis in Power BI. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power Automate flows for approval processes and what are some best practices to ensure efficient approval routing? Your answer should be, I would start by defining the approval workflow, including approval steps, participants, conditions, and escalation rules. Utilizing built-in approval actions, dynamic content, and parallel branches, along with implementing error handling and notifications, ensures efficient and reliable approval routing. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is, what are the key considerations for designing Power BI reports and dashboards for mobile consumption ensuring optimal performance and usability on mobile devices. Your answer should be designing reports with responsive layouts, optimizing visuals for mobile viewing, and leveraging features like mobile layout view and offline access ensures optimal performance and usability of Power BI reports on mobile devices. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power Automate flows for batch processing or bulk data operations ensuring efficiency and scalability? Your answer should be designing flows with batch processing actions or triggers, implementing pagination or chunking for large data sets, and optimizing data processing and manipulation tasks ensures efficiency and scalability in batch processing workflows in Power Automate. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the capabilities of the Power Platform Admin Center and how it enables governance, management, and monitoring of Power Platform environments and resources? Your answer should be the Power Platform Admin Center provides centralized management and governance capabilities for Power Platform environments, including user management, license assignment, data policies, and users' analytics, ensuring efficient administration and monitoring of Power Platform resources. Our next interview question is, what are the considerations for designing Power Virtual Agent chatbots for conversational AI, enabling natural language understanding, NLU, and context-aware responses? Your answer should be designing chatbots with intents, entities, and utterances 
training the chatbot with sample dialogues and user interactions and leveraging natural language processing NLP capabilities for context-aware responses, ensures conversational AI and natural language understanding in Power Virtual Agents chatbots. Our next interview question is how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for ad hoc analysis and exploration enabling users to dynamically interact with data and perform on the fly analysis? Your answer should be designing reports with interactive visuals, slices and filters utilizing features like drill down, drill through and bookmarks and enabling report interactively. Interactivity and exploration ensures ad hoc analysis and exploration in Power BI reports and dashboards. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the role of Microsoft Power Apps portals in extending Power Platform solutions to external users or customers and how do you ensure security and authentication in portal deployments? Your answer should be Microsoft Power Apps portals enable external users or customers to interact with Power Platform applications via web portals. Ensuring security and authentication involves configuring portal access controls, implementing authentication providers like Azure AD and enforcing data access policies. Our next interview question is what are the options for integrating Power Automate with external systems or services using custom connectors and how do you ensure data integrity and compliance in integration workflows? Your answer should be Power Automate can integrate with external systems or services via custom connectors, APIs or Azure services like Azure Logic Apps. Ensuring data integrity and compliance involves implementing data validation, encryption and auditing in integration workflows and connections. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is What are the considerations for scalability and performance when designing solutions with Power Platform? Your answer should be understanding data volume, concurrency, and users' patterns is critical. Optimizing data queries, leveraging caching mechanisms, and utilizing premium features like dedicated capacity in Power BI or Power Apps ensures scalability and performance. Our next interview question is, how do you handle exceptions and errors in Power Automate workflows? Your answer should be implementing error handling mechanisms such as retry policies using scope actions for grouping actions with a common error handling strategy and leveraging terminate actions to gracefully handle exceptions or effective approaches. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the integration capabilities of Power Platform with other Microsoft products such as Office 365 and Dynamics 365? 
Your answer should be Power Platform seamlessly integrates with Office 365 applications like SharePoint, Teams, and Outlook, enabling data exchange and automation. Integration with Dynamics 365 allows for extending CRM capabilities with custom applications, workflows, and analytics. Our next interview question is, how would you approach designing a Power BI dashboard for executive level decision making? Your answer should be, I would start by understanding the key performance indicators, KPIs, and decision making requirements for executives. Designing visually appealing and intuitive dashboards utilizing features like drill down, slices, and bookmarks to provide actionable insights and facilitate data-driven decisions. Our next interview question is, what are the best practices for maintaining and governing Power Platform solutions in an enterprise environment? Your answer should be establishing a center of excellence, COE for governance, defining standards for solution development, implementing version control, conducting regular audits, and providing ongoing training and support are key best practices for maintaining and governing Power Platform solutions. Our next interview question is, how do you ensure user adoption and promote the use of Power Platform within an organization? Your answer should be providing comprehensive training and documentation, fostering a culture of innovation and empowerment, showcasing successful use cases, and soliciting Feedback from users to continuously improve the platform experience are effective strategies for driving user adoption. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the licensing considerations for deploying Power Platform solutions in an organization? Your answer should be, understanding the licensing model and user requirement is crucial. Different licensing plans offer varying capabilities and features. Evaluating the needs of users, considering factors like data storage, premium connectors, and administrative features ensures compliance and cost effectiveness. Our next interview question is, what role does Microsoft Dataverse, formerly known as Common Data Service, play in Power Platform solutions. Your answer should be Microsoft Dataverse provides a secure and scalable data storage platform for Power Platform applications. It includes a standard schema and supports custom entities, relationships, and business logic, facilitating seamless integration and data management across Power Platform applications. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is, how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for predictive analytics and forecasting leveraging machine learning models or statistical algorithms? Your answer should be integrating predictive analytics models for forecasting algorithms using Power BI built-in features or custom visuals, configuring model parameters and data inputs, 
and evaluating model performance and accuracy ensures effective predictive analytics and forecasting in Power BI reports and dashboards. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the capabilities of Microsoft Dataverse for Teams and how it extends the functionality of Power Platform within Microsoft Teams environments? Your answer should be Microsoft Dataverse for Teams provides a built-in data platform within Microsoft Teams for storing, managing, and integrating data with Power Platform applications. It extends the functionality of Power Platform by enabling app development, automation, and collaboration directly within Teams environment. Our next interview question is, what are the considerations for designing Power Virtual Agents chatbots for multilingual support ensuring effective communication with users in different languages? Your answer should be designing chatbots with language detection and switching capabilities, implementing multilingual responses and prompts, and utilizing translation services or Language resources ensures effective communication and support for multilingual users in Power Virtual Agents chatbots. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for benchmarking and performance comparison, enabling users to analyze and compare metrics across different categories or periods. Your answer should be designing reports with comparative visuals like bar charts or line charts, utilizing slicers and filters for dynamic selection of categories or periods, and incorporating benchmarking calculations or reference lines ensures effective benchmarking and performance comparison in Power BI. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the role of Azure Data Lake Storage Gen 2 in Power Platform Solutions and how it facilitates data storage management and analysis at scale? Your answer should be Azure Data Lake Storage Gen 2 provides a scalable and secure data lake storage solution for storing and managing large volumes of structured and unstructured data. It facilitates data integration, processing, and analysis at scale for Power Platform solutions leveraging Azure services and connectors. Our next interview question is, what are the options for integrating Power Automate with external notification systems or messaging platforms enabling real-time alerts and notifications for users? Your answer should be Power Automate can integrate with external notification systems or messaging platforms via connectors, APIs, or webhooks. Implementing automated workflows triggered by the events or conditions and sending notifications via email, SMS, or chat messages ensures real-time alerts and notifications for users. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is, what are the key considerations for designing Power BI reports and dashboards for data governance, 
ensuring data quality, consistency, and compliance with organizational standards. Your answer should be implementing data governance policies, standardizing data sources and definitions, establishing data lineage and documentation, and enforcing security and access controls ensures data quality, consistency, and compliance in Power BI reports and dashboards. Our next interview question is how do you approach designing Power Apps solutions for scalability and performance, ensuring optimal responsiveness and efficiency as user load increases? Your answers should be designing apps with efficient data retrieval and processing, optimizing app performance with delegation and formula optimization, and implementing Caching and load balancing strategies ensures scalability and performance in Power Apps solutions. Our next interview question is Can you discuss the options for extending Power Automate with custom connectors of Azure services? And how would you approach developing and deploying custom integrations securely? Your answer should be Power Automate can be extended with custom connectors developed using Azure API management or Azure functions. Developing and deploying custom integrations securely involves implementing authentication, encryption, and access controls and adhering to best practices for API security. Our next interview question is what are the considerations for designing Power Virtual Agents chatbots for integration with human agents or live chat support ensuring seamless handoff and collaboration between automated and human assisted interactions? Your answer should be designing chatbots with handoff capabilities implementing routing and escalation mechanisms and integrating with collaboration tools like Microsoft Teams ensures seamless handoff and collaboration between automated and human-assisted interactions in Power Virtual Agents chatbots. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for advanced analytics and data mining? Leveraging machine learning models or advanced statistical techniques? Your answer should be integrating machine learning models or advanced statistical algorithms into Power BI reports using Azure Machine Learning, R or Python scripts, and configuring parameters and inputs for advanced analytics ensures accurate insights and predictions in Power BI. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the role of Power Automate Desktop in automating desktop and legacy applications and how it complements Power Automate cloud services for end-to-end -end automation? Your answer should be Power Automate Desktop enables automation of desktop and legacy applications using UI recording and robotic process automation RPA capabilities. It complements Power Automate cloud services by extending automation capabilities to on-premises and desktop environments for end-to-end -end automation scenarios. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600.
you can download the complete list of Microsoft based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is Can you discuss the options for integrating Power Virtual Agents chatbots with external systems or services? And how would you approach securely accessing external data from chatbots? Your answer should be Power Virtual Agents chatbots can integrate with external systems or services via custom connectors, HTTP actions, or Azure services like Azure Functions or Azure Logic Apps. Securely accessing external data involves implementing authentication mechanisms, data encryption, and access controls in chatbot workflows. Our next interview question is what are the considerations for designing Power Apps solutions for offline scenarios enabling users to work with data and applications without an internet connection? Your answer should be designing offline enabled Power Apps involves implementing local data storage, synchronization mechanisms, and conflict resolution strategies. Utilizing features like Power Apps offline capabilities and Azure services like Azure SQL database ensures seamless offline experiences for users. Our next interview question is How do you approach designing Power BI datasets for complex data modeling scenarios? such as many-to-many -many relationships or dynamic aggregations. Your answer should be handling many-to-many -many relationships in Power BI involves creating bridge tables or using DAX techniques like cross-filtering and bidirectional filtering. For dynamic aggregations, utilizing DAX expressions with functions like calculate and summarize enables flexible data modeling in Power BI datasets. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the role of Microsoft Power FX, formerly known as Canvas Power Apps formulas, in building low-code applications with Power Apps and how does it simplify app development? Your answer should be Microsoft Power FX is a low-code programming language used in Power Apps to build formulas for app logic and calculations. It simplifies app development by providing a familiar Excel-like syntax and supporting formula-based expressions for data manipulation and automation. Our next interview question is what are the options for embedding Power Virtual Agents chatbots into custom wave applications or portals and how do you ensure seamless integration and user experience? Your answer should be Power Virtual Agents chatbots can be embedded into custom wave applications or portals using iframe embed code direct line integration or Power Virtual Agents SDK. Ensuring seamless integration involves styling the chatbot interface to match the host application and implementing authentication and authorization mechanisms. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power Automate flows for long-run long-running processes or background tasks, ensuring efficient resource utilization and monitoring. Your answer should be designing asynchronous flows with appropriate trigger mechanisms, implementing batching and pagination for large datasets, and utilizing delay and timeout actions ensures efficient resource utilization and monitoring 
for long running processes in Power Automate. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the capabilities of the Power BI REST API and how it enables programmatic access to Power BI resources for automation and integration? Your answer should be the Power BI REST API allows developers to programmatically access Power BI resources such as datasets, reports, and dashboards for automation and integration purposes. It provides endpoints for tasks like data import, report embedding, and managing Power BI artifacts. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is, what are the options for extending Power Virtual Agents chatbots with custom language understanding capabilities and how would you approach training chatbots with industry-specific or domain-specific terminology? Your answer should be Power Virtual Agents chatbots can be extended with custom language understanding using Azure Language Understanding LUIS custom entities and intents. Training chatbots with industry-specific terminology involves defining custom entities and training phrases based on domain-specific languages and jargon. Our next interview question is how do you approach designing Power BI reports and dashboards for real-time collaboration and teamwork, enabling users to share insights and collaborate on data analysis. Your answer should be designing reports with shared workspaces, real-time collaboration features like co-authoring and commenting and enabling sharing and publishing options ensures real-time collaboration and teamwork in Power BI for sharing insights and collaborating on data analysis. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the capabilities of Power Automate Desktop and how it extends automation capabilities to desktop applications and processes? Your answer should be Power Automate Desktop allows users to automate repetitive tasks and workflows across desktop applications and processes using Robotic Processes Automation RPA capabilities. It provides features for UI automation, wave scrapping, and integration with desktop applications enabling efficient automation of manual tasks. Our next interview question is, what are the considerations for designing Power BI reports and dashboards for embedded analytics, ensuring seamless integration and white labeling within custom applications or portals? Your answer should be designing reports with embedded visuals or iframes configuring embedded settings and permissions and implementing single sign-on SSO for seamless authentication and access control ensures seamless integration and white labeling of Power BI reports within custom applications or portals. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power Automate flows for business process orchestration, ensuring coordination and synchronization 
of tasks across multiple systems and services. Your answers should be identifying process dependencies and workflows, designing flows with conditional logic and parallel execution paths, and implementing error handling and transaction management ensures effective business process orchestration in Power Automate. Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for extending Power Virtual Agents chatbots with custom analytics and reporting? And how would you approach integrating chatbot inter interactions with analytics platforms or reporting tools? Your answer should be Power Virtual Agents chatbots can be extended with custom analytics and reporting using Power BI integration, Azure Application Insights, or custom telemetry and logging. Integrating chatbot interactions with analytics platforms involves tracking and logging chatbot events and interactions for analysis and reporting. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is how do you approach designing Power BI reports for real-time or near-real-time data streaming scenarios? And what options does Power BI offer for real-time data visualization? Your answer should be utilizing streaming data sets in Power BI configuring data sources for real-time data streaming and designing reports with streaming visualizations like line charts or gauges enables real-time data visualization. Power BI offers options for integrating with Azure services like Azure Stream Analytics or Azure Event Hubs for real-time data ingestion and processing. Our next interview question is, what are the key considerations for implementing role-based access control, RBAC, and data security in Power Platform solutions, especially in scenarios involving sensitive or regulated data? Your answer should be defining security roles and permissions based on user roles and responsibilities, implementing role level security, RLS for data filtering and enforcing data loss prevention DLP policies ensures RBAC and data security in Power Platform solutions. Utilizing features like Azure AD integration, data encryption and auditing enhances security and compliance with regulatory requirements. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power Apps portals for multi-language and multi-region support and what options does Power Apps offer for localization and globalization? Your answer should be designing portal pages with customizable content leveraging language resources for localization and Utilizing portal themes and templates for multi-language support ensures effective localization and globalization in Power Apps portals. Power Apps offer options for dynamic content localization, multi-language site settings, and custom language selection controls for a localized user experience. 
Our next interview question is, can you discuss the options for extending Power BI reports with custom visuals developed using the Power BI Visuals SDK and how would you approach developing and integrating custom visuals into Power BI reports? Your answer should be Power BI Visuals SDK allows for developing custom visuals using HTML, CSS, and TypeScript and integrating them into Power BI reports. Developing custom visuals involves defining visual properties, data mappings, and rendering logic and integrating them into Power BI reports using the custom visuals interface or Power BI desktop. Our next interview question is, how do you approach designing Power Automate flows for integrating with on-premises systems or legacy applications securely? Especially in scenarios where direct cloud connectivity is restricted. Your answer should be utilizing on-premises data gateway for secure connectivity between cloud services and on-premises data sources, configuring data connections and credentials securely, and implementing encryption and access controls ensures secure integration with on-premises systems in Power Automate flows. Our next interview question is, what are the best practices for managing dependencies and version control in Power Platform solutions, especially in scenarios involving multiple developers or teams collaborating on projects. Your answer should be utilizing solutions packaging for managing solution components and dependencies, implementing version control with source control systems like Azure DevOps or GitHub, and establishing release management processes ensures effective dependency management and version control in Power Platform solutions. If you are preparing for any Microsoft-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below. Today we are discussing the interview questions and answers for Microsoft Power Platform Solution Architect PL600. You can download the complete list of Microsoft-based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on PL600 is can you discuss the options for extending Power Virtual Agents chatbots with custom analytics or insights? And how would you approach integrating analytics services or algorithms with chatbots? Your answer should be Power Virtual Agents chatbots can be extended with custom analytics or insights using Power BI integration, Azure Cognitive Services, or custom analytics algorithms. Integrating analytics services involves defining data sources, metrics, and visualizations and embedding them within chatbot conversations or dashboards. Our next interview question is what are the key considerations for designing Power BI reports and dashboards for large-scale deployments, ensuring performance optimization and scalability. Your answer should be designing reports with efficient data models, optimizing visuals and calculations, utilizing incremental refresh and partitioning, and distributing workloads across multiple data sets or reports, ensures performance optimization and scalability in large-scale deployments of Power BI. 
Our next interview question is how do you approach designing power automate flows for cross platform integration ensuring interoperability and compatibility across different systems and environments Your answer should be designing flows with platform agnostic connectors and protocols implementing data transformation and mappings and testing compatibility and interoperability across target systems and environments ensures seamless cross platform integration in power automate our next interview question is can you discuss the options for extending power virtual agents chatbots with custom authentication mechanisms and how would you approach integrating chatbots with identity providers or external authentication services your answer should be power virtual agents chatbots can be extended with custom authentication mechanisms using azure ad b2c oauth or custom authentication providers integrating chatbots with identity providers involves configuring authentication flows token validation and user attribute mapping for seamless authentication and authorization Our next interview question is what are the considerations for designing power bi reports and dashboards for executive or management level decision making ensuring high level insights and strategic visibility Your answer should be designing reports with executive dashboards strategic KPIs and summary visuals utilizing features like drill through and slicers for detailed analysis and incorporating trend analysis and forecasting ensures high level insights and strategic visibility in power bi our next interview question is how do you approach designing power automate flows for robotic process automation rpa enabling automation for repetitive tasks and workflows your answer should be identifying manual or repetitive tasks designing flow with rpa actions or ui automation implementing error handling and exception handling and testing automation scripts across different scenarios ensures effective robotic process automation in power automate our next interview question is can you discuss the role of power bi data flows in data preparation and etl that is extract transform and load processes and how they enable data integration and cleansing your answer should be power bi data flows allow users to extract transform and load data from disparate sources into a centralized data repository they facilitate data integration cleansing and transformation using power query transformations and data flows ensuring consistency and accuracy in data preparation for power bi If you are preparing for any Microsoft based certifications you can download the complete list of valid tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below